what's up everybody i'm in greenville south carolina about to do a podcast with my bro alan he is the host of the we need to talk podcast so we are out here about to go up in here do a little episode you know what i'm saying if y'all haven't seen the we need to talk podcast go and check it out so yeah i'm about to go up in here see what's going on answer some questions be on one episode and then i'll also share the episode with you all whenever it drops I'm just waiting for him right now little parking situation was a little, little strange, you know what I'm saying? But segue into something else. That's the cool thing about like being in YouTube black and um, meeting up with other creators is that you know you all share a common interest and then you try to figure out like if you can collaborate, if not, cool. These hallways long as this. So this used to be like an old factory or something. Had mm-hmm. to be. Text out, man. Dang. Yeah, it's another one down the street. Oh, for real? Mm-hmm. This one, I think this one's older, or this one was renovated earlier. Okay. Right, but yeah, it was, uh, it was a textile mill, probably 1800s, early 1900s, something like that. This old there. Wow. Mm-hmm. There's some nice views out here, though. Made me want to give me a loft. Man, <laughs> the only problem with these lofts, though, is everybody, I don't know if you're a dog person, everybody and your mom got a dog. Oh, yeah, I can see them. And I'm, and I'm walking up in here, I'm like, dang. And some places are worse than others, like some places you'll see, like, Duke in the hallway. <laughs> is that a, that's a TV? What that? Yeah. Oh, dang. It's one of the frame joints. How the hell? Yes. I've been trying to fool somebody. <laughs> what is to fool somebody. That ain't no TV. I swear to God, man. That joint look like a um painting. Yeah, with the zebra on it. I thought it was a painting or something. Yeah, it's got what kind of that's nice though. I like that. Yeah, you can switch up the painting. Look, you see that thing? Wow, that joint flat too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's nice. I don't see that. Look at that. Look at that. I-, I thought about getting like a more expensive frame. There's some frames that like you know, like in the art museums, the gold frame, the thick ass gold. Oh frame, yeah. You could actually get one of those for this. Really? So it would fool you even more, but it's like this is not Wow. It's not. Yeah, I was like, what in the world? <laughs> yeah. Dang. First not trick, so I'm happy about it. Yeah, you got me. I'm like, what the <laughs> He got me. He That's got the wire me. right there. That's what connects everything. That little line right there. Oh. Mm-hmm. That's wow. what connects everything to like a little box. Alan. We Shut need up. to talk podcast. We about to shoot some fire. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what I'm be talking about yet, but you know. <laughs> if, we tell the truth, <laughs> if we tell the truth. Nothing but the truth. Man got the equipment up in here. Look at the whole studio. This the behind the scenes. Y'all probably don't know much about this. So yeah, basically, I'm be sitting in this chair right here. Talking, answering questions. You know what I'm saying? Got the black on the day. Got the... Travis Scott song, you know what I'm saying? He got the Sony, you see what I'm saying? Y'all know I'm a Canon guy. These Sony's nice though. They be making me want to go Sony, man. I was saying, I'm, I'm thinking about going Sony, looking at these Sonys, bro. Oh yeah? I can't. It's, it's, it's sharp. I like the small body style too. Yeah. Cause you know the R6 is a little bit it's bulky. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You so got a battery grip on it or just a... Nah, I just okay. got a regular, but it's... Still bulky to be traveling with sometimes. I hear they're more durable though. They are That's durable. The thing, I done dropped that thing. Yeah, they That's are durable. Fragile. But tell them a little bit more about the We Need to Talk podcast. Tell them. Shit, man, we're trying to get to the truth. We're trying to, um, we're trying to hear black people's like truth, hear black people's stories. Yes, sir. Uh, we're trying to bridge the gap between understanding between black men and black women. Yes, so sir. That's it, man. That's the man with the plan. You know, if you ever seen the videos, he don't be on camera. He be behind the camera. It's, it's interesting because um, We Need to Talk started as a nonprofit. Okay. okay. Yeah, was, I started recording the discussions in college. Oh. And so, like, everything kind of just culminated later on. God, it's with the YouTube shit. Okay. Yeah, so it just. You just put it all in. I was, yeah, I was trying to, like, keep this going, but then I can't do it in person right now, so let me do the YouTube thing. That's true. Okay. Yeah. That's a big 
big thing on your yeah, channel. Yeah, what, yeah. what does minimalism mean to you? How did you find minimalism? And you know, also you don't see too many black people yeah. on yeah. minimalism too. Yeah. So like, talk about yeah, that, man. Actually, I was excited when you said, "Yeah, and we're black." I yeah, was like, yeah. <laughs> that's perfect. You know, so easy. Yeah, yeah, you know. Uh, but to me, minimalism means just living life with intention. You know, I think we, especially in the black community, we grew up where it's like a lot of consuming. You gotta buy this to seem like you make it in life. You gotta have this to seem like you rich and you trying to stand out against other people. But honestly, I think, especially when you're trying to get married, the time has to be right. Yeah, you could be in love. Yeah, you could be head over heels for each other. But if the timing isn't right, you could be rushing something that's not going to last that long. If you were talking to a Let's say your son in the future, you know what I'm saying? Or well, uh, a young mentee. How would you explain women to him in a way that would help him avoid some heartbreak, some right. you know what I'm saying? Like what 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 how have you learned to conceptualize women yet? Yeah. Um, as you, you know, got mature and stuff, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I think I would say, and two or three, um, I would say just a sense of softness. You know, I feel like a lot of women is trying to be hard these days. We're going to talk about it. You know, you know <laughs> trying to be <laughs> hard. You know what I'm saying? Trying to be, you know, but tapping into that softness and, you know, tapping into that femininity and keeping that and allowing that to really make the man feel more at ease too um, is a green flag. And I think my last one would be... <laughs> Why do you think so many of our women feel the need to be argumentative, be belligerent, be, you know what I'm saying, you got it. Like you'll hear a lot of times, uh, he can't handle me. Because they don't want to seem easy, you know? They don't want to seem easy like it was an easy catch because I think a lot of women think that we equate a woman being challenging, I wouldn't say argumentative, but challenging, um, hard to get, is more worth our time. Mm. Oh. Yeah, y'all, we done, we done wrapped up the video. Now I'm saying? It's been a great time. I'm gonna have to come back. Sure. If, if he allowed me to come sure. back. <laughs> if he allowed me to come back. Man, appreciate appreciate you. you, man. Can't wait to see it. Yeah, absolutely, it's man. gonna be great. Yeah. And yeah. I can't wait. Yeah. That went well, guys. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Can't wait for the episode to come out. I will share it with you all once it do. And uh, yeah, so since I'm in Greenville, excuse me, I've been drinking a lot of water today. Um, I'll be heading out to Parks on Reedy. I think that's what it's called, Falls on Reedy. Check out Greenville a little bit, then head back to Atlanta tomorrow. So yeah. You looking at me. <laughs> I didn't know like, who you're talking to. See that little brunch spot right there. Oh, that is the brunch spot. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Oh, if we just go these steps, that's how we get up there. Right. Okay. But I like Greenville. Yes, yeah, it's, it's not. Area. It's not too bad. Not too bad. I like this better than Columbia. Definitely Ooh, better. Definitely whiskey. Definitely better than Columbia. Yeah. thing I hate about traveling back home is when I get home, I don't, be, I don't be feeling like doing nothing. Like, I legit don't feel like doing nothing, which I need to do laundry. That's for one. I need to go to the gym. That's for two. I need to find something to eat for dinner. That's for three. I need to edit a video. That's for four. But all I feel like doing is laying down and it's gloomy outside. 
that's that's the downside y'all but i appreciate y'all for watching the vlog today like i said i will be trying to vlog some more this year i know y'all like when i vlog here and there so you know i try to share as much as i can when i can um but if y'all like the video go ahead and leave a like go ahead and comment in the comment section that helps your boy out also you know whenever the video drop with we need to talk podcast i will be linking that in this video and then i'll also um, post it to my community tab as well so y'all can go check that out it's gonna be a great conversation um but yeah like i always say appreciate all of y'all and i'll get y'all in this video Peace. I've been calm, cool, collected, but you pushing on my nerves And knowing your intention, I'm under pressure Okay, I'm admitting that a couple things I said Got acidic in the tone, in the presence, I get careless Long as you know, I come with imperfections When you look at me, you see the soul through my flesh You something special Know you looking bomb, the way you dress it gone Flex it, hold it still and let my mind digest You got the leverage